headlines from this year's statistical review of world energy. Viewed from the perspectives of, of the energy transition to a lower carbon environment, this year's data is a bit of a mixed bag. Global growth in energy demand was a lot stronger this year, in part because gains in energy efficiency were less good. Coal, after declining very sharply for three consecutive years, grew in, in 2017. Carbon emissions increased by over 1.5% last year after being essentially flat for three years. But on the other hand, renewable energy continued to grow strongly, led in particular by extraordinarily strong growth in solar energy. Natural gas was the fastest growing source of energy last year. So natural gas and renewables together accounted for around 60% of the growth of energy demand. So 60% coming from cleaner energy in the form of renewables and natural gas. And I think the right way of thinking about this is sort of two steps forward, one step back. The performance that we'd seen in the three years leading up to 2017, some of that reflected long-term structural trends, but some of it was amplified by short-run cyclical factors which were unlikely to continue going forward. Move forward into 2017, some of those short-run cyclical factors have gone back into reverse, and so the, the headline numbers we see this year have to be seen in the context of that big progress we'd made in the, in the previous three years.